If you want to use air gestures on Realme GT7 T, first of all, we have to go to settings. Now in the settings, scroll all the way down and go to accessibility and convenience. Over here, scroll down again in order to find smart sensing. And then you should be able to find air gestures. Over here, we can find two gestures, the air call control and air scroll. In this case, we're going to start with the air call control. Of course, over here, we have the preview. But we can tap over here in order to first turn on this option. We need to press agree and continue. Over here we have the description. So we can hold the back of our hand uh, from the front uh, camera with our fingertips pointed down. So essentially something like this. And then when uh, a prompt appears at the top of the screen, so next to the camera, uh, you can flick our hand to answer the call. You can press learn gestures in order to of course figure out how to use it. We also can mute calls so if our, if we hold our hand to the front camera um, with our fingertips pointed up so just like this then uh, when the prompt appears at the top of the screen we can keep our hand still for one and a half seconds and then we will mute the call. So just tap learn gestures in order to find out how to uh, use them we will have these tips so you can follow them uh, in order to learn how to properly use these gestures i'm going to also now go to the air scroll what is quite important here is that only selected apps work with this gesture so unfortunately not everywhere we can use this gesture in my case um, i can use it on facebook tiktok and youtube of course if you download more apps perhaps they will be supported here um, I think, yeah, over here we can actually read which apps are supported. So in addition to these three, also Instagram is supported. So very limited options, but at least it is something than uh, just nothing. And here in this case, um, what we can do is we can scroll down with our hand. And of course, we can scroll up as well. We can once again use learn gestures in order to find out how to use this option. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.